For this boss, I'm going to use a positive charge because it does more damage during good parts of the fight. One of my main strategies here is to run back and forth past him to trigger his close range attacks, then just turn around and deal damage when he misses. If he raises two red paws in the air, you can get multiple good hits in from behind. When he stands on two legs and gathers electricity, run to the side of the stage to avoid the area attack. For his red beam, just use your shield to block it. If you can get near him, it's worth taking a little damage to get some big hits in during the attack. I recommend running over the traps right away so they don't mess you up during the fight. It's also a good idea to kill the skeletons immediately because they'll do heavy damage if they grab you. Just remember to jump over the red sparks when you down them and then defeat the crawling corpse. When the boss does his double lunge, try to dodge in the opposite direction of his second attack and run to the edge of the stage to avoid the incoming blast. Here I'm just going to take a little damage while he shoots his beam to get in some big hits. Keep attacking him while he transforms until his feet turn red and become surrounded by sparks. It's easiest to avoid the sparks by jumping over one, running back, and then jumping over the next. Afterwards, try to dodge away from him to avoid his follow-up attack. Whenever he uses area attacks is a good time to heal. The lightning is pretty easy to avoid, just try not to get too greedy because it can catch you off guard. If he does a clone attack, try to dodge around his mouth and wait for his final bite before attacking. It's really easy not to get hit if you dodge to the side with his clone and then run in for an attack. During the last part of the fight, focus most of your energy on aggressively killing the spawned enemies. You may get hit a couple times, but you don't want to have to fight them for long with the boss. Okay, and that's it for this fight. Thanks for watching and see you next time.